Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. School was out all over Kentucky today, but in Frankfurt, a lesson was being delivered. Thousands among thousands of educators and supporters descended upon the Kentucky Capitol grounds Monday morning to protest pension reform and show support for education funding. This is about the kids. This isn't about teachers. This isn't, a, isn't about pensions. At this point, it's about sustaining public education in the state of Kentucky. This isn't just about our pension. This is about all the funding that he's cut from our kids, from our schools. We're a little independent school, and without that funding, we don't have an opportunity. Monday's rally was set to coincide with legislative budget talks set to take place in the Capitol building. Demonstrators marched along Capitol Avenue and then up the Capitol steps, cheers and chants ringing out. Those in attendance were united in their pushback against last week's controversial passage of Senate Bill 151, which makes hotly contested changes to the structure of educators' benefits and to the governor's proposed budget, which could drastically affect education funding. This is not just about us. That w The things that this governor is doing and all of his friends in there, it is a direct attack on public education. He has an agenda and I feel like that this has been in the works for years now. You know, we're fighting for kids, we're fighting for public schools. You know, we've got, there are, there are fire fighters here, there are police officers here because it affects everybody. It affects our local economy. You know, the schools are gonna get big cuts today. We don't know where we're gonna come up with the money for, but you know, just like Dan said, you know, we're giving all these tax cuts to big corporations and the wealthiest folks. Who's going to shoulder it? Working people. And educators were not the only ones letting their voices be heard. We're here to support public education. That's what this is all about, supporting our teachers. Not only are we here to support education, but we're here to support our officers and law enforcement too. Uh, as for myself, I'm affected by both sides of it, working for the school system and the local police department. Everybody has a favorite teacher and we hope that everybody will come out to support their favorite teacher, even if it's only one. We hope to see our representatives listen to the majority of people here who want to see our teachers get treated the right way. Demonstrators were relentless in their indictments of state officials supporting the controversial education bills. Some lawmakers who have pushed back against the bills made their way through the crowd to cheers and handshakes. You look around, you can see how we're fighting back. These, these are folks. This is, this is something that touches every family, every person in the Commonwealth of Kentucky. And we're excited to be here. All my colleagues are here. And while the state's governing body sat inside the Capitol building, the state's educators did their best to blow the roof off the building and shine a light on what they believe has been governance in the shadows. In Frankfurt, Chris Anderson, EKB News.